What is up, everyone? Welcome to Ra Rax Rabs. I don't know how to say this. Crib. Ra Rags Crib, right? Crib. Ragnarok. There you go. Uh, yeah, close enough. Good enough for me. Ooh, it's got like a disco music. I like that. Oh, I see custom weapons. Yep. A K7. That's a good Pack one. Act 12. Oh, I love it. K7. Oh no, it's timed gameplay. That's not. Uh, don't press F. Uh, I picked up a fart. Why? I see Minecraft Fortnite. Oh my gosh, this is this is. <laughs> Just come over here. Hi. Right. Look at my gaming setup. Whoa, whoa, what are you doing over here? This is mine. Don't Look press this. F. Give me your Minecraft <laughs> and Fortnite. <laughs> this is a meme map. Bro, it's like a lot of annoying. Today I played God of War, and it was best day ever in two minutes. I will sleep and have my alarm set for one, so I can rise and grind. And when I wake up, I can continue God of War. Some of these days, I wonder when I'll be able to play God of War again. I hate sleeping, showering, and even eating because that forces me to not be able to play God of War, the best, greatest, best God of War game of all time. When I die, bury me. God of War, so I can continue playing God of War while playing God of War. Love you, God of War. One of those God of War meme stuff. Alright, Ah, Phoenix up. Jesus Christ, you fucking bombed them! Did you, did you not think they had a fucking wife and family and so kids we have a doors. And, and cousins? They were happily married. Got time they power, had eight though. children and you this, fucking this... bombed them with a nuke? Are you fucking sane? Are you a sane human being? What the hell is wrong with you? That's kind of a meme. It's kind of annoying, though. Funny! Is it constantly blasting uh, sound? Yeah, constantly being annoying in a way. You know how they put the memes out, like, oh, you hit them with the nuke, blah blah blah, like, yeah, it's Oh, it has custom sounds to it? <laughs> yeah. You did have a girl, like, I knew it. So you pop it in, I'm like, wait a second. Yeah, I got Phoenix, though. I shouldn't have grabbed it, I thought it was, I can't see. To shoot anything that moves, so I thought I would give you more ammo because you can never have enough ammo. Here you go, have fun. Dropping spree, baby. Night by all the doors. But we need power on, so I would say I would save it. I already got it. Oh no, because there's we we, we got make power. I'm buying all the doors so I can. Oh, this is kind of a big map. Uh, end game 50,000 right here. Nice. End it. End it. Uh, shopping tree doesn't work on endings. Try it and see. If it does, then let's end the video. Bro, it doesn't work. You're wasting it my time. Give me your ass! <laughs> Give me your ass! Just after the door or something. Uh, how, oh, there you go. Anything you do now is double the points because you're rolling seven. Because it is double the points. I cut apart. There's a door over here if you didn't, if you didn't uh, buy it. I'm trying. Where's where, where, where? Right here, right here, right here. I'm out of it. Point sharing is gone. Alright. Ooh, I got a battle axe. Jesus Christ, kind of, kind of you fucking bombed him! Did you, did you do not think they had a fucking wife and family and kids and, and cousins? You have any power. They were happily married. They had did you pick up the switch? Uh, yeah. With a nuke. Okay, let me, just, let me go make it. Sane? Are you it's a dark sane in this human house. being? What the I... hell is wrong with you? Hey, yo, Crib Dog, get on the ass, fool! <laughs> kind of funny. Ooh, now this is good. That was a good one, actually. Crib Dog, get on. Get on this. Extra credit, I'll take that. Crib Teddy what, do you, what do you have in your hand? A battle axe. Because God of War. I got- I just got some Marriott's. Number 
one rule in Naptown is to shoot anything that moves. So I thought I would give you more ammo because you can never have enough ammo. Here you go. <laughs> have fun. You could never have enough ammo. That's actually a good one, dude. Oh, I forgot this door. Pack is open. Oh, Ooh. listen. It's been five days. Barrier hasn't gone away. The fog seems to get thicker every day. I don't know how much longer I can subsist off of the scraps of food that are still left in the kitchen. Every trip up there seems like it's been We can do it! Let's build some barriers! But it's given me time. Time to think, time to look around. Time to explore what little of this realm I can. What I found, it, it doesn't make sense. Give me your nuts, sir. Countless dead bodies, crash planes. It seems like there's been other people here. They're all dead now. I'm getting to hope that there is a way out. A way out that is death, of course. But even in that situation, I'm still not sure I'll ever actually escape. You know, it would have been great if I could hear it better, but. Oh, there's another one up here. Come on. Oh. Give me your ass. Give me your nutsack. Oh. Yeah. Up over here. Up top. Oh. They have his voice. They have his voice. They have his voice. It's not just his either. Everyone's not the voice. Of the Everyone who's ever been here. Calm down. That's what you become. That's what happens to you. When they get you, you become one of them. And then, it's just echoes of how you were. Mindless, soulless echoes of what used to be a person. If you can hear me, help me. Oh, I'm in the front of the house. Give me your ass. Yeah, this I don't really know much to say about this map. I'm trying to hear everything, but because it's like it's not like memes being thrown around. Okay, there's like a all thing. Okay. You are here. You fucking bombed them! Did you do not think they had a fucking wife and family and kids and, and cousins? They were happily married. They had eight children and you fucking bombed them with a nuke? Are you fucking sane? Are you a sane human being? What the hell is wrong with you? 
All right, give me extra credit. Ah. Trigger finger ready and start shooting some zombies. Every kill that you get now is double the points. Anything you get, oh, extra credit. Because it is double the points. Double the points. Uh, pick it up. Alright, that was it. I'm trying to find this song. Yeah, that's another skull. Skull found. Hey, yo, Crip Dog, get on the ass, fool! <laughs> so funny stuff. Private cheering. That's good. Yeah, this map is kind of a troll. I was just like, I'm just trying to listen to everything. I'm sorry. But yeah, if I'm not saying anything, it's that's why. I really don't know how to react to this map. It's kind of funny, but it's like, it's kind of irritating. Like, and Jairus doesn't hear anything, because he doesn't have sound. That's right. He never plays with sound, so like, I'm the only guy that has to heal this stuff, so like, it's hard to, it's can't, it, you know, it can't start a conversation with this guy about it. You know what I mean? Or you just pay, you choose to just pay attention to the sound. Uh, yeah, so that, well, then what, what, am I, what is everyone supposed to listen to? Nothing? Hmm? The sound of silence. You know, I start a conversation. Alright, let's do a conversation. What do you want to talk about? There are many things we can Really? Like what? Yes. But I don't, I, I don't want to interrupt your music session. Ah, talk. I don't care. We're giving a All conversation. Right. We got pedo bear. For an example. Oh man, target. And target stuff. Pedo bear is an old thing, dude. That's and an old got target. Thing. Target loves pedo bear. That's why they put. That's why they put gimp kid, gimp things in front of their, in front of the kids. Their uh, little kid section. For their pride month. Or whatever. Oh, they're trying to strike, strike the iron. Strike what? Strike the iron. Strike like, the okay, iron. Bud Light, they, they messed up. But us, we can make it better. We can oh show them God. how to Dude, it's really like, tough. okay, let me explain like this. It's like the meme, right? You guys, you, know, you ever seen the meme? It's the picture of the guy walking with his girlfriend down the street. And then there's this like, one girl. He literally, this hot woman, walks down and passes him. And he turns around and he goes, ooh. While his girlfriend is angry, kind of look at him, looking at his or boyfriend with disgust. That's what it is. It's Dylan Mulvaney walking down the street, and Bud lights the guy, going ooh, and the girlfriend is Target, going what? He beat me to it. That's that's the meme that we should be making. Target is the is the girlfriend. The Dylan Mulvaney is a hot person. Hot girl, basically. That Bud Light went for it, and then Target wants to go for it now. I'm just get back outside. And also, and then guess what happened? They got kicked in the nuts because they, because their uh, their customers don't want like creepy stuff going towards their kids. That's why. Because Target put things in front of young kids and parents. Okay, probably have like because if you guys don't know, apparently Target employees are being are being assaulted. 
Not by conservatives, because there's no way conservatives can boycott, boycott fast enough in turn. A company. It takes them forever to do anything. You know what really happened? I'll tell you what happened. A group of regular people walked into the store one day with their kids, and they saw right in front of them Pedo Bear and the Gimp outfits for the kids. And they went, What the? What is that? And then next thing you know, they told the, the mommy, the mom tells her kids to cover their eyes and run out the store as fast as they can because they're horrified at what they're seeing. I, I can't take my kids to this indecency. That's what they're going for. Going with. And then, then there's the more confrontational, the men. So, I'm just here for a case of beer with my little girl who's grabbing a beer. And then he, he walks into the store looking for his case of beer. Hey, Bud Light, obviously. Because he ain't gay. And then basically, he runs into the GIMP outfit. The GIMP stuff. And Beetle Bear in Target. And guess what happens? He gets angry and wants to get confront the, the, the Target staff. Because guess what? Now his kids are asking him, Daddy, what's a lesbian? And he goes, what the? Where did you hear that from? And next thing you know, Target staff are getting questioned. That's how it happens, man. Bro, well, I wonder why. Do you think why? Do you think they learned lesson from, from Bud Light and the boycotting? Why would the CEO or the owner of Target approve and start putting it on their shelves? As soon as you right when you walk into the doors. Bro, get, I just to told you why. Section. I just told you why. They saw Bud Light and they went, "Ooh, that looked good." And and they said, "I want to get kicked in the nuts too." <laughs> and then guess what happened? They get kicked in the nuts and they go, "Owie, okay, that didn't feel so good." <laughs> I wonder why my. my I wonder my why Bud Light, million. why Bud Light didn't apologize. I guess we'll just move our LGBTQ stuff to the back room with their gift outfits. That's the reality. Yeah. You know why? It's because ESG. That's the whole reason. It's the ESG nonsense. That's what it is. Alright. That's it. Yeah, I'm kind of done with this map. This map is kind of fun. But it, the memes are just too much. Anyways, like, subscribe, you all. Uh, game link is in the description. I hope you guys see. Uh, like, I hope you guys subscribe. It helps out a lot. Yeah. App link is always in the description, and I hope to see you guys next time.